Hi guys and thank you very much for tuning in and watching this channel. I appreciate your time, comments and feedback. Today we will be uh, doing a review on one of my favorite tool around my home workshop, which is the Bosch Inspect or Bosch Universal Inspect camera. I bought this camera about uh, two and a half years, almost two and a half years in April 2018. And since that time, I have used it in multiple occasions where I needed this extra uh, vision to go in places where uh, hard to reach. Uh, for example, I used it on my Jeep to uh, to go through the dashboard to, to run wiring. I used it to, to go through my uh, wall cavity to run wiring. I done it uh, in inspection. Uh, my compressor basically my workshop compressor i done a rust inspection inside it and this is one thing actually i will make a, a, a separate video on the safety of the compressors and how long you need to do this inspection so i done the inspection using this camera i used it for uh plumbing checking for uh, to check on on leaks um i use it also in my dishwasher maintenance and i, I actually uh, there's some footage here of the blockage that I had on the heater element and with the tools provided in, uh, with, the, with the camera I, I was able to clear the, the blockage and get the dishwasher to work. So it is one of the tools that has multiple uses uh, or you once you start using it the, you'll have unlimited uh, time to use it. Uh, so. Speaking about the camera, the camera basically is uh, is made uh, made by Bosch. It comes in this in this very nice pouch uh, with uh, extra tools, which is bucket for extra tools, and it makes it easier to mobilize around the home workshop in a car and in a situation where you need it. It's, it's very light. It's about I think uh, about four hundred grams, uh, included the, the tools. So about 400 grams, I'm not sure this in pound would be most probably a, a one pound. Um, as we can see here, that's basically the pouch. And getting to the camera itself, uh, the camera itself is, uh, uh, we have the, the display unit and we have the camera itself. The camera, the camera is an uh, 8 mil camera. Okay, and it has four LED in the head of the camera. We have four LED, which is very bright, and you control it from this button. This button basically will uh, control the, the, the LED lighting and also change the contrast of the picture. Um, we have the button here, which is on off, and you hold it also in, in the mode to, to delete photos. We have the zooming. It has the ability to zoom uh, uh, 1.5 to 2 times. Um, and then we have also the image rotation. This is unfortunately is not in the way you take the photos. Uh, however, you can in a live viewing, you can uh, manipulate the angle of the item that you, you are viewing. We have the but this button here is the shutter button. You are able to take uh, photos with the camera. We'll get to that later on. And we have the uh, basically the gallery view where uh, you are able to view the images that you, you're taking. Uh, if we look at the lead that, uh, or the cable, it is a flex, uh, flex lead. It's uh, about uh, 95 uh, centimeter or just five, 50, 50 mil, uh, uh, five centimeter, uh, less, than the, uh, less than a meter. And uh, it's about, in, in, in imperial, it's about three feet long. So it is good to reach, uh, you have a bit of a reach for, for further things uh, when you're doing inspection and also manipulation of the camera. If we look at the display itself, it has a, a display of 2.3 inches uh, screen and it is actually a clear display. It, is a, it has a sh very sharp, uh, sharp image. Uh, the camera is a 6 volt powered camera and it get, uh, and it, it gets its power from a 4 uh, a time 4 1.5 volt AA battery, double A batteries, as we can see here. Um, actually, I haven't changed the battery since I got this camera two and a half years ago. And um, it has automatic feature. Uh, the, 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 battery, uh, the battery can last up to four hours continuous use. And uh, the, 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 the unit itself charts power 
uh, after 20 minutes of non-use. So it's it's actually got this battery saving uh, saving feature. If we look here, it has a memory card, uh, macro SD card, which is basically takes anything from uh, four gig to 32 gig, and Another feature of that is once you insert the card, any any uh, uh, picture that you have on your internal memory, memory, it's automatically transferred to your memory card. So you don't have to press button, you don't have to go through images. Everything that you have there on your uh, local memory will go on your memory card uh, in a folder created uh, under Bosch and it will delete the local memory so the local memory is clear. The lo local memory on the camera, unfortunately, it doesn't take too many photos, it's uh, about eight photos, and it deletes the, the old images. So if you're working with this camera and you're taking images, just be aware it's only eight uh, uh, photos basically, and you have a chance of losing uh, all the images. So you will have to back it, uh, to back your images uh, as regular, especially if you're doing reporting and anything else um, so we'll power it on and we'll get a bit of a, of a view so that's powering on and we can see here I'm, I'm pointing at the box okay and this is basically if we can look at the camera here this is my this is the LED uh, off this is 50%, 100%, and this is now a black and white contrast, basically, on the last mode. Um, the zoom, if you can see here, we have our uh, two level of zoom. We have the 1.5, two times, and then we have the normal view. Uh, this is the shutter, so basically we can take a photo of the whatever we're viewing. And in here, we can go into the gallery mode and we can go through the photos. This is actually one of the blockages that I had on my dishwasher. I don't know if it's clear to the camera. And that's my kid playing with the, with the camera. Okay, to go out again, we go on the shutter uh, button and we are out of the, or to the second mode basically, which is a live view. In a live view, we are able to press the 180 degree rotation. So you can rotate and manipulate uh, the camera to get uh, a proper viewing, okay? So that's basically it, guys, regarding that. The, as I said, there's other tools that come with the camera, which is basically, it is not things that's uh, much, but it, it is things that you can depend on to do uh, basic basic stuff. I still have them actually because they are lit, little bits and pieces so I have them still in the original plastic. Um, I should actually talk them before I start recording. Okay, so we have a mirror. We have here a magnet and we have a hook Oops. and we have a small a small hook personally i used only these two these two tools um, i use this one to uh, to recover uh, in my jeep to recover as one of the uh, trim uh, screws which is basically fell into a tight space and i use this one to basically uh, I use the camera to navigate to where the, 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 the screw is and I use the magnet to retrieve it. So I use this one and the hook, basically what I used recently on the clearing of the, uh, the blockage in my, in, my washing, uh, in my dishwasher. So how do you use them? We have this piece of plastic, which is basically, it slips, it slips on top of the, of the camera. So we have here, sorry, to start with, uh, this will slip in here, like that. There's a groove, I don't know if the camera showing show it. There's a groove here, or a ridge, on the round uh, part. And then on the camera itself here on both sides, 180 from each other, we have a hole. So you're gonna clip this one in here, in a hole. Okay, then basically you're gonna install 
this thing on top. Sorry, it's unhooked out of the hole. Okay, you guys get the picture, but yeah, this is how it's how it gets used. And you put your camera on and you manipulate and you can hook whatever you, you need to hook. Okay guys, that was a quick this, uh, quick review of this product. I really uh, recommend, recommend it for anyone who looking at a, a small nifty camera for an inspection and so on. I will uh, most probably do a, um, uh, one uh, video on the compressor, uh, the compressor inspection, and I will be using this camera. So stay tuned and thank you very much. And as always, stay safe. Till the next time.